please subscribe to our channel and for latest update click on the bell icon now we will do a composition on my class teacher all of us love our class teacher isn't it we must learn to love now what will you when you want to write a composition on my class teacher let us see what is it we have to think first what are the things we have to remember as a class teacher first her name what kind of person yes then how she deals with the, the students how she teaches how pleasant happy friendly she is all that you have to write then how much the children like her why they like her why that is good right? and finally the two children whether they are happy or not happy with the class teacher so that's what you think of so when me, when a teacher gives you write a composition on your class teacher these are the things you have to bear in mind so we will write about we will learn to write about my class teacher class teacher is the most important person in your life why because it only when you like your class teacher when you begin to love your class teacher you will be able to learn better in a junior school you must have a good class teacher so that she disciplines you she teaches you she loves you she corrects you she helps you in learning forming your character forming your handwriting and helping you to go step by step into the next class so when you talk about my class teacher what is the first thing that must come in your mind when you say your teacher you remember her with not only her face or smile but her name now so you will say my class teacher is mrs pavitra so and so we'll say then what kind of a person she is a charming person lady a happy person your class teacher need to be a happy person only if you a teacher is happy can you be a happy learner when she teaches to you happily you accept from her what she is delivering to you you grasp it happily retain it in your mind produce in the paper so you have to remember her name what kind of a teacher was she was she a ta- charming person a happy person a soft spoken person a gentle person was she a beautiful person that's what you could then what are the normally a class teacher teaches most of the subjects some teachers teach only one subject so maybe your class teacher was an english teacher and a science teacher whatever and how she taught you or handwriting teacher how she taught you step by step lesson by lesson did she teach you well did she simplify the lesson she did, did she get you interested in the lesson did she help you to love the lesson okay then how did she help you to remember all the points how much of effort she put in so was she a teacher was always angry i know it with the little things naughty things you all did or was she a sportive person a happy person overlooked all your naughtiness encouraged you all the time explained in a very simple manner making you understand even the most difficult lessons or difficult sums was she a teacher like that was she an eager teacher to help your you was she a strict teacher was she a teacher who was all the time bothered of forming shaping your character your personality so the, all these things you have to bear in mind was she, was she a disciplinarian yet bringing out the best out of you so think of all this when you are writing about my class teacher all 
all right. So now then uh, how did she do? Next is how? How did she go about teaching? Did she only talk with the book or did she bring charts? Did she play games in the class? All these things you have to bear in mind. Finally, students, all your classmates, did they love her? So, now we will write about my class teacher. Okay? My class teacher is a charming lady, was a charming lady. Okay? My class, you can give a name also. Okay? My class teacher will give her a name. Okay? My class teacher, say Mrs. What can we say? Mrs. Sara. Okay. My class teacher, Mrs. Sara. Okay. Sara is a charming, a happy and charming lady. Is a happy. A teacher need to be happy, I told you. Happy and charming. That means she can win over all the students. And she is a happy and charming, charming lady. So your class teacher is a teacher, Mrs. Sara is a, she is a happy person, charming person. All children, all students automatically love a happy and charming teacher. Then what else can you say? What does she teach you? She teaches us. What does she teach you? She teaches us English, and science. Okay, English and science. So she's a science teacher. She's your English teacher. She's also your class teacher. Now, what kind of a person was she? She is a gentle kind and a cheerful person. What kind of a lady she was? She is gentle, she's gentle, kind, she's gentle with you, she's kind with you and then soft, soft spoken. She's gentle, she's kind, she is soft spoken and a cheerful and a cheerful person. We always want our teachers to be happy, cheerful, soft spoken, gentle with us. Only then we can listen to her, understand what she is trying to teach and retain in our mind and write. Okay, so my class teacher, my class teacher, Mrs. Sara is a happy and charming lady. So you want your teacher to be happy and charming lady. Then she teaches us English and science. She is gentle, kind, soft spoken, and a cheerful person, a happy, cheerful person. And that is the junior school teacher. Then, what does she do? She encourages. Okay? She, what does my class teacher do? My class teacher my class teacher encourages So that means she helps all the children, not one, all, she give encourage, come on you can do it, little more you can write, write nicely, your handwriting is good, oh you are such a nice child. So the class teacher, my class teacher, what does she do, she is all the time encouraging children, she encourages us and 
always encouraging and explains the lessons and explains huh? explains the lessons how does she explain the lessons and makes it easy to understand. So, she and my class teacher encourages us and explains the lessons and makes it easy, makes it easy to understand. So, what does the child want? The child wants the teacher to be gentle and kind happy, cheerful person. Then the teacher must teach us, isn't it? Why is teaching? What is she doing to you? My class teacher encourages us. Oh, you're very good. Please sit up straight. Listen to me. Ah, what a nice girl. Encouraging all the time. Saying something positive all the time. And explain. How does she explain? Explains the lessons. How? And makes and makes it easy to understand. So, all the children are able to understand what she is taught, what she is trying to teach. Then, but she is also strict and a disciplinarian. She is also strict and also disciplines us. So, she not only explains make the lesson easy for us to understand. She is also, she is also strict. She is a strict teacher. She is also strict and maintains discipline. Strict and maintain discipline. Ah. That means she is disciplining the children. She is strict. She disciplines them, makes them understand, encourages them, also help them by making the lesson easy to understand. That is the kind of teacher you have. What is the kind of teacher you have? My class teacher, Miss Sarah, what is she? She is a happy person. A cheerful person, a charming lady. Then, what does she teach you? She teaches you English, she teaches you sign. Then, what kind of a person she is? She is gentle, she is kind, she is so soft spoken and she is cheerful all the time. How does she teach? She teaches, my class teacher encourages us, explains the lesson and makes it easy to understand. She is also strict and maintains discipline. Okay, she also, she is strict and she is also strict and maintains discipline in the class. So, you can't do what you want in the class. She will be a strict teacher. She will help you to maintain discipline in the class. But also help you to learn. Okay, what else she do? What else the class teacher does? She makes learning interesting. My class teacher, my class teacher, my class teacher makes learning very interesting. My class teacher makes learning. very interesting. Why do you like your teacher? Because she makes, my class teacher make learning very interesting. How does she make the class very interesting? By bringing colorful charts and flashcards. She makes, she makes colorful She makes nice colorful charts.
and flash cards. So, she makes the class interesting. How will we learn? We learn by seeing. How will we learn English spellings? By flash card. So, my class teacher Sara, she is so good. She makes the learning very interesting. How? By bringing colorful charts and flash cards. Then are you happy about your teacher? Yes, we are, we are happy to have a lovely teacher, a lovely teacher. So what do you do? You pray for her, may God bless your teacher. So when you have a nice teacher, a lovely teacher, how will the learning take place? You will remember everything. So the first thing is when the teacher says write about my class teacher, you have to bear in mind which class teacher you love so much, why you love her so much, what is her name, what are her qualities, what does she teach you, how does she teach you, how does she make the classroom learning interesting. Only when you are happy with your teacher, can you learn and retain things in the, in your mind. So, my class teacher, writing about when you say class teacher, your favorite class teacher. Only when you love your class teacher, can you remember. So, which is your favorite class teacher? My class teacher is Mrs. Sara. She is a happy and charming lady. Your class, your class teacher, Sara is a? Happy and charming lady. She teaches, Sarah, what is Sarah teaches? Sarah teaches us English and science. English and science, she teaches. She is gentle, kind, soft spoken and a cheerful person. A happy teacher creates a happy classroom and children love her and they learn easily. Now, what do the class teacher do? My class teacher encourages us and explains the lessons and makes it easy to understand. So what she will do? She will encourage, she won't scold, she won't shout. She will encourage each person. She will say good word about each child and then she will encourage us and explain the lesson. She takes the lesson, she will explain it how in a very simple manner helping us to understand what she has been teaching. She is also strict. If you don't listen, she will say, look here, listen to me. She is also strict teacher and she also maintains discipline in the class. So she is strict with you. She knows you have to learn. She is strict and she is a disciplinarian also. Finally, my class teacher makes learning very interesting. Whatever the topic, she makes it learning a very happy, interesting situation. Then she makes, to make learning interesting, what does she do? She makes colorful charts and flash cards. Then we are happy to have a lovely teacher like Mrs. Sara, lovely teacher like Mrs. Sara. So that's your class teacher. Okay. So now you know how to write. If you want to write a lengthy composition on my class teacher, then you will say what is her name, whether she's married, whether she got children, how long she was teaching in that school, huh? whether your sister also studied under her. Then uh, you can say how she teaches English and science, what experiment she, compl she uh, conducts, then she is a cheerful person. Now, when you talk about the class teacher Sara, you want to write a lengthy composition, then you will say, when you say encouraging and explaining, how she explains, what are the things she uses, what are the, how she encourages children, that you can uh, explain on. And then uh, finally, making learning colorful by using char charts and uh, flashcards and finally how teach children begin to love her, remember her and score good marks. So let's go through what we have written here. My 
class teacher. My class teacher, Mrs. Sara, is a happy and charming lady. She teaches us English and science. She is gentle, kind, soft-spoken and a cheerful person. My class teacher encourages us and explains the lessons and makes it easy to understand. She is also strict and maintains discipline in the class. Then my class teacher makes learning very interesting. How? She makes colorful charts and flashcards. We are happy to have such a lovely teacher like Mrs. Sara. If you write like this, short correct sentences, your teacher will give you nice marks.